Yep. This is the height adjustable lathe. We're at our booth at Gas in uh, Seattle. But uh, just to demonstrate a bit about the tool, um, height adjustable is wonderful. This whole thing is totally water sealed. So when you're done working, you can hose the thing down or drop it in the river to clean it off if you want. But it's got two adjustable uh, positions. This, this shaft is oiled, bare, uh, greased. Um, loosen this up just a little. Loosen the adjustment. And if you want to sit down in a chair while you're working, there you go. This is all articulate so it can be adjusted to be beneath it. The uh, splash pan looks like a big Harley Davidson bender. Has a drain in it. Uh, that can be adjusted similarly quite easily. Loosen that up. So, gives you a lot of room to work around your glass. Bring that back up. That down. You like the stand? There is an armrest available for it, so you can position yourself much more comfortably while you're grinding. But if you're uh, if you work for the Harlem Globetrotter, you could have it up here. But uh, all totally enclosed. Tighten this back up. The working end very Loosen that up. This whole spindle comes out. There are collets in here. You don't have to take it off. Well, I want to. This can be adjusted. And there are collets that can go in here, and you can hold up to I think eighth of an inch or smaller. So this fits in. Tightens up. There. The other, you can adjust and change the wheels. So, it's like, with, wore it. where's yours? <laughs> We're putting on the wheels. Also put on the, the one inch spherical, uh, the four inch spherical miracles, any of the wheels, really. Now, totally on off. When, it, when it's off, you can open this control box. All the controls are in here. This is a three-phase motor. It's all adapted and adjusted in there. So it's all magic. But it goes to 110 single phase. Right. This is all 110 single phase the way it's plugged in now. This is the uh, interlock. When it's all closed up, and turned on, you would not be able to open it. So it's a great safety factor. Like I said, it's all totally sealed, so you can hose it down after you've been working with cerium and the whole thing looks white. Just clean it off. You can adjust the, uh, the speed here up to 2,000 RPM. We're just setting it for 1,000 for demonstration here. So that's on. Here's your start-stop. These wrenches down below so they don't wipe right off. Starts up and runs very smooth. It's a slow start, and off you go and grind. Water adjustable, here's a little extra splash card you can use or not.
keeps it from getting all over you. Water adjustment here. We're not hooked up to water, so I'm not going to demonstrate. Um, when you're done to, uh, when you're ready to stop, that turns it off. Um, or you can use this off switch down below. Uh, this is much more convenient. It's in the stop position. If you turn it, now it's ready to be turned on again. The uh, Moffett light is also totally waterproof. Positional bowl where you want it. You see what you're doing? Not much else to say about it. Got a wonderful counterbalance. Whole thing weighs a little over 800 pounds and it is very stable. Uh, when it's on an unbalanced floor or an unlevel floor, <laughs> if you just loosen these two bolts and this bolt, uh, the manufacturer says you can jiggle it and it will cock the legs to make it perfectly stable and tighten them all back up. Uh, you put it on little rubber pads and it's just not going to move, it's not going to walk out of your shop. And he's like every one he makes, he improves on a little bit. So if you order one and it doesn't look like quite like this, yes, yes. that means it's better. Um, price is $8,200 plus shipping. And um, it'll be a favorite shot. Favorite in the shop. No.